And here we are with a little uh, get back to the previous guide. First, I want to correct that the first add doesn't cleave anything with its TBs. Then, on Symmetric Surge on the second boss, you should actually put your spread uh, away from the other duo, and that way you can heal before the share, because the two shares are close together, but they do not clip. So it's easier for healers. Okay, and then we will see the last mech of uh, Statis, the last hard mech, which is Pinwheel. So first there is a dart on one color. In this picture, it's yellow. You have to check which AoE has an outer edge with the two opposite colors. So here, blue and red. This will be your new north. We'll you will get debuffs. Two random darts, two chains, one sub, one DPS, and one enumeration, which is not on the chain. The enumeration will always go to the new north. Chain stack mid, waiting for the chains to appear. Then, if you are a chain support, you go west. If you are a DPS support, you go right. One of them will have to circumvent a rotating AoE. For darts now, if there is a dart on a chain and enumeration, the enumeration will always adjust. It's the same if the dart is on the opposite uh, chain player. Enumeration always adjust because they have nothing else to do. The chain already have to break their chains. If the two chains have a debuff, the chain that went straight, so which didn't add an AoE, will adjust. And if, if the two darts are on enumeration, then they can just uh, place themselves in different tiles. Okay, let's see. So the fixed pin is on the yellow color. So we check for a red and blue outer edge. We can see it's north of my screen. This is the new north. This is where the enumeration will go. And west and east will be the chains. All right, so I have a chain. I am support, so I'll go west. I wait, as soon as I see an AoE, I can go. So this is a defamation, right? I break the chain, and then since I have no dart, I have nothing else to do. So here we died because someone failed a dart. Okay, let's go again. Now the fixed dart is on blue, so I have to check a red-yellow on an AoE and it's there. This is a new north. We wait for chains. And I do not have any chain. So I go north and I will just have to resolve my dart. You also have to be in the enumeration. So here I didn't look where the other dart was, so we will wipe. This is why when you are north, you really have to check early where the other dart is. Okay, let's go again. Let's see uh, how we see. So blue pin. Okay, red yellow is the new north. I don't have chain, I will go north, I have dart. And you will see I will check really early where the other dart is going. Okay, it's, he is going on right, obviously, right? So I will just stand on yellow. And this should do it. Yeah, so here they died because they didn't break the chain in time. But, and we die because I took AoE rotating and autos. Okay, fix pin on blue. I check for red, yellow, outer edge. This is a new north. Okay, so be careful. We can see that I have a dart, but I also have an enumeration, right? And the two circles are blue. So I actually forgot that I had a dart. And you shouldn't. This is a bit of a mess visually, right? So I check, the pin is on yellow. We check red plus blue, it's a new north. I have nothing, no chain, no dart. So I have nothing else to do than go north. 
and be in the enum enumeration. Okay, in this clean. Don't forget to dodge the AoE, they rotate a bit more after the mechanic has ended. Okay, and for the last bullet mech, you will have a share spread, then you will have a force march plus a slice, depending on the bullet, and then you will have share spread opposite with the last force march. Congrats and good luck!